everybody, welcome to Tom's Tips, and today's tip is uh, is for One for the Road. One for the Road is a member of YouTube who asked me a, a specific question: is um, how do I calculate the size of the radiator for the room? Well, today I quite simply go on to um, bestheating.com. I'll put a link up here: bestheating.com uh, BTU calculator. I think it's called. So in there, you just put the size of the room. Uh, how wide it is, how tall it is, how long it is, uh, what's underneath it, heated room, you have drop boxes so you, you just put in the drop box, uh, heated room, concrete floor, etc, etc, size of window, and at the bottom when you've done all the questions you, you put calculate and it tells you how many BTUs or how many watts that you need for that, for that uh, side of the room. So then you can look for a product list, you press the product list and it'll give you a list of radiators that will suit that. But that, they're doing this because they're a firm and they sell radiators. So you don't need to buy the radiator from them. Once you've got the, the BTU, what they need, let's say it's 9,000 BTUs. You just need to go on um, one of the major uh, screw fix, get a screw fix catalogue or tool station catalogue or B&Q one. Look through what's got that, and you, you know you get the size of the radiator from there. Uh, in, in my day, we had to work it out with, with a long uh, calculation with a pen and a calculator, and it took forever. But uh, then somebody came out with a Mears calculator. A Mears calculator is like a round thing with all the rings turn, and you know that makes it easier. But Today, uh, I've no doubt you can get an application to put on your phone to do it. So there's plenty easy ways to do it where there wasn't. And of course, you can always uh, use one of my standard methods, which is uh, whatever, however wide the window is, put one in just short of the window. Now that might sound a bit haphazard, but it's not really because who's ever calculated for a room they've had to put a window in to let the certain amount of light in. So that calculation sort of goes uh, in relation, the windows are in relation to the size of the room and the radiator also is in relation to the size of the room and if in doubt just put a bigger one up. You know as long as you've got enough in the room it's okay You can because you can put a thermostatic radiator valve on it to govern that as long as it's not too small. Right so um, if anybody else uh, as any questions regarding central eating or plumbing or whatever you can come to my forum now it's up here i'll put a link in for that and you, you can talk to other plumbers as well as me there's uh, we've got quite a few plumbers on there uh, plumber boy um, tappy and enfield we've even got dick poor over there you know he comes along and he's he, he gives his view of everything uh, so you'll all be welcome come along share things around the table. Anyway, it's winter now and I've got a dash. Uh, there's people wanting jobs to me, so I'll catch you all later. 